Okay people, today we're going on a shrimp adventure. So it's going to be shrimp. And I'm going to put a twist to it. It's going to be shrimp curry in garlic. Okay. And it's going to go with rice. Steamed rice. So as you can see here, I have all my ingredients right here. Tomato, sweet pepper, cilantro, I got the garlic, I got the curry, I got uh, chili powder, I got allspice pimento, and I got some braised browning. Yeah, so let's start the process guys. Right now, this shrimp comes with some unstripped tail, so I'm gonna break off the tails. Yeah, so I'm gonna break off the shrimp tail right here. All right, break them off one by one so it doesn't have to be in the food. So I'm gonna break, break off the shrimp tails, yeah. One by one, limb by limb, one by one. We're gonna break them down, break them down, yeah. Breaking out the shrimp tails. Fast. And then break off the shrimp tail real fast. And then after I break off the shrimp tail real fast, I'm gonna uh, start the process of seasoning up the shrimp in the bell pepper and all the rest of seasoning and sauteing the shrimp real fast. It's gonna be another epic move. So I come to show you what shrimp can do. Shrimp can do. Alright, yeah. I come to show you what shrimp can do. Alright. So, yeah, here we go, guys. Shrimp tail, I'm, I'm breaking off. Working up all the shrimp tail already. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna wash these shrimp in some lemon lime, lemon or lime, which one can see. Breaking up these shrimp, I'm gonna wash them. Wash these shrimp in some. Because I come to show you what shrimp can do, shrimp can do, shrimp can do. I come to show you what shrimp can do. Yeah. And it's probably something new. Okay. I come to show you what shrimp can do. And it's probably something new. Alright people. So those shrimp tails are gone. 
what I'm going to do next, I'm going to have this um, shrimp right over here. And the first thing I'm going to put on my shrimp is some browning, grace browning. Put some grace browning on my shrimp. And then I'm gonna put some um, some dry jerk seasoning on my shrimp. Dry jerk seasoning. See the dry jerk seasoning here? With the browning, put it in. All right. After the dry jerk seasoning going on, I'm gonna add the garlic. Add in the garlic. Add in the garlic to my shrimp. All right, right here. Okay, that's two step. After I add the garlic to my shrimp, I can start turning on my stove now. Yeah, turn on the stove and, and then I'm gonna add some pimento to my shrimp, right? Add some pimento to my shrimp. I'm gonna add some bell pepper, sweet pepper, some garlic. All right, add the sweet pepper to my shrimp. Get it washed off first before I put it up. Yeah, so I'm gonna add the sweet pepper to my shrimp. Uh huh. Add the sweet pepper, cut them up. Not real nice. I notice people I use a green sweet pepper. I have other color like the yellow and the red, but I'm gonna use the green sweet pepper. Because um it's gonna go with this shrimp gonna go with some curry, so I want to have this um red, gold and green look. Yeah, so stay tuned guys. Wait till I show you what it looks like. So, in the meantime, I'm doing this. I'm gonna um, have some oil in the pot. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have some oil in the pot here. And this can be coconut oil. It can be some coconut oil. I'm gonna have in the pot. Yeah. Maybe some coconut oil I'm gonna have in the pot. Real coconut oil. No joke. I don't use butter. I can't eat butter. And for the people who eat butter, it's up to you to use butter to do your thing. Whatever you do, Make sure you can digest it, you know? So, I'm gonna add the curry and I'm gonna burn the curry. So here I'm adding some curry to my um, coconut oil and I'm gonna burn it, burn the curry. And in the meantime, while the curry is burnt, I'm gonna I'm gonna use this um I'm gonna cut up the onion. Okay. So while the curry is burning, I'm gonna cut up the onion. And I'm gonna add it to the shrimp. So the onion I'm gonna add to that um, ingredient in the shrimp. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. Only I'm gonna add to the shrimp while the curry is burning. Yeah. And this is a one, two, three cooking people. Simple. When it's a one, two, three, you mean real simple. You know? Not gonna be a hard cooking today. Real simple. Okay. I'm gonna add some chili powder. some chili powder while I add some chili powder I'm gonna add tomato one tomato 
I'm gonna add one tomato. So let me cut this tomato up on people. You can smell this curry already. This curry is like whew, this curry smells so good already, people. Oh gosh, I'm telling you man. This curry smells so good already. You know? Uh, yeah. And I'm gonna put some of my favorite ingredients in this uh, curry. Let them pop and and then having some cilantro here that I'm gonna cut up in it too. Mm-hmm. Yep, cilantro. Mm-hmm. cilantro in the curry I'm gonna put some Himalayan pink salt on top of this curry yeah okay all right so yeah one more thing people looking for this spoon yeah so the curry is gonna be but we go on into the Himalayan pink salt with the cilantro. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna add all these ingredients here. Curry and everything. The shrimp. The shrimp gonna be mixed around with all these um, vegetables. See the shrimp inside here. Mixing with all these vegetables and I'm gonna add it to the pot. Now the shrimp is added to the pot. I'm gonna show you what it look like. Now the shrimp is added to the pot. This is what it looks like people. I'm gonna bring it to a saute with the vegetable, the onion, the bell pepper, the tomato, with the um, all spice, the Jamaican dry jerk seasoning, mm -hmm. the paprika, all of this gonna come down. You know, all this can come down to a real saute flavor. You know, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna spin this around. Spin this around so I can um, actually get the ingredient to like the curry to um, soak into the shrimp yeah so I come to show you what shrimp can do what shrimp can do what shrimp can do so yeah so I'm actually spinning around the curry in the shrimp you know, with all of this um, bell pepper and cilantro, onion, tomato, curry, you know, all of this thing, you know, tomato, curry, you know, all of this can come down. One saute flavor, yeah, yep, mm -hmm. all of the 
is coming down. So, in the meantime, let me add some water to this. We add some water to this and bring it down to a boil, people. Uh, in a few minutes from now, we're going to have curry shrimp. You know? Yeah, curry shrimp is coming. Yeah. Yeah. So, what I'm going to use to have with it, what I'm going to serve with this curry shrimp is going to be steamed rice. I'm gonna have the rice here to this spot. Like maybe two cup of steam rice. Yeah. Two cup of steam rice here. Mm-hmm. Two cup of steam rice and I must wash this rice good. I'm gonna wash this rice. Strain it off. Yeah. And then I'm gonna add water to it and a little salt. And a little of that coconut oil. After I wash that, this rice, I'm gonna add the water, little salt and some coconut oil. And I'm gonna put it on the, the fire to um, cook. Okay, people, yeah. So this is going to be the fire for the rice. It's going to be the fire for the rice. Alright, the rice is on. So let me see how this curry is. shrimp is coming now. Yeah, this curry shrimp is coming real good. Real good. Yeah, this curry shrimp is coming really good, people. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This curry shrimp is coming really good. And I can add some onion to this one, too. Add some onion to this curry shrimp. Mm-hmm. Cut up some onion on this curry shrimp here. Right away some onion going on it. You know? Mm-hmm. Some onion on this curry shrimp. You know? Onion going in it. Mm-hmm. What else? I'm gonna put some thyme in it. I got the powdered thyme today, people. Yeah, and I might put some rosemary in it too. Yeah, got the rosemary. Got the rosemary here. Yeah, I'm gonna put some rosemary and a little grated ginger. Stay tuned. Let me show you what it looks like in a bit. So yeah. Rosemary gonna go in and I'm gonna grate a little ginger on top. Grate a little ginger on top of the shrimp. So it has this ginger flavor, you know? Yeah. Okay, and ginger, clean it off here like this, so the ginger is in it, okay, if you only smell this already people, it smells so good, all you need to do now is to have the vegetable like the sweet pepper cook, and as soon as the sweet pepper cook, this curry flavored shrimp gonna be ready and i'm serving it with some steamed rice so stay tuned people all right so yeah 
the steam rice now for the steam rice I'm gonna add some coconut oil yeah I'm gonna add a little coconut oil to the steam rice a lot of people use butter but I don't really eat butter so I'm gonna add the coconut oil and um, the coconut oil now I'm gonna add a little of the Himalayan pink salt again to my rice all right all right so yeah it's another step and with the coconut um, oil and the salt to the rice I'm just gonna cover it a bit half cover it a bit and then you know with the shrimp now I'm gonna put some anato food coloring I'm gonna put anato food coloring you know I'm gonna put a little anato remember anata some people call it nata so I'm gonna put a little nata food coloring to bring that color up yeah 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 and um moama shrimp tastes like real coconut flavored shrimp so people have some coconut sugar rather you don't like sugar but this coconut sugar is not really super sweet so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna have a little teaspoon of the coconut sugar into the shrimp yeah so the shrimp is coming down the curry shrimp is coming coming down to the real kind of you know cooking process where it's gonna go down a bit and then I can turn off the stove on it it's gonna be ready and you know, I don't really eat shrimp, so I'm gonna um, serve it to somebody. But believe me, people, it's not what you eat that you cook sometimes. You just have to know how to cook it. You notice I'm not gonna even taste this shrimp. I already know that it has in everything that's gonna taste good. So yeah. Stay tuned guys, so shrimp is coming down, while the shrimp is coming down I'm going to clear my counter off, put back whatever I don't use in the fridge, like some of these um, sweet pepper and all of that, and you know, so it is. Okay, what next? So I'm gonna put back the curry and all this thing into the you know, yep, all of these things going back into the cupboard. Yeah, all of these things going back into the cupboard, the all spice, everything. Yeah. As you can see here the curry shrimp is coming down coming down and I can add a little more curry to bring up the um, the flavor to this uh, curry shrimp I already burned some curry when I was starting so this curry is gonna just bring up the flavor you know fridge sensitive keep it open too long it tell you you know okay so that's what happened so yeah guys this thing is going well smells good so i'm gonna spin it around yep curry garlic shrimp all sauteed down 
Spot is like bubbling up too. Mm -hmm. Before you know this dish will be ready to be served. Alright. Mm -hmm. Okay. Take up these little thing off the counter and should be ready in a bit. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Curry shrimp. Oh yeah. Curry shrimp for calm down people. Look at it. Got this shrimp. See that? See this curry shrimp? Look at it. See this shrimp there? Ooh, look at this curry. See that? See this shrimp? Garlic, bell pepper, tomato, cilantro. ingredient is in this one yeah different spoon for the rice because I don't want to mix up the um, the shrimp spoon with the rice as I'm telling you I don't eat shrimp I'm doing this for my folks here yeah so yeah so the rice is gonna be Ready in a bit. Shrimp is already ready actually. I'm gonna turn this stove off in a minute. Uh, the shrimp is super ready. Look at the shrimp people. Look at the shrimp. Look at the shrimp. See that? Curry shrimp in you know? Look at the curry. Look at the curry. See that? Oh yeah. So we need to turn down a bit on this side with the rice. Yeah. Rice pot a bubble. Curry go well with white rice people. So that's why I may use white rice to go with this curry shrimp. But I was saying already, I don't eat shellfish. So I'm just doing this for my folks here in the house, you know? Yeah. So look at this shrimp. See that? See that? Okay. Mm-hmm. The shrimp is ready. Okay. Shrimp is already cooked. So the rice left for steam now. All right, so, yes, people. Yes, people, look at this. 
shrimp that you know you see that shrimp all saute saute down in the bell pepper and the um, onion and the scallion and the tomato and the cilantro and the rosemary and the garlic you know pinch of Himalayan salt you know curry shrimp you know people now go normal so yeah that's one step the other step now is my um, steam rice coming up over here people so steam rice there steam up real good mm -hmm. okay the thing is coming down real nice all right get this counter prepared because before you know you know it's gonna be ready to serve yeah all right rice pot i'm gonna lower the fire i don't know what i'm gonna eat for myself today with this rice but i'll figure it out in a bit Rice a steam up. Rice a steam up. Cut the rice. See the rice? Alright, let me stir the rice one more time. Stir the rice one more time. Cut the rice is a kind of sticky rice, you know. Now, if you make sure, see, we stir it. Yeah. Sorry, the rice, uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, people, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel. Hit, hit the notification bell so you can get notified when I put up new video. Yes, people, it's another epic move. Jamos Kitchen. Mm-hmm. Much respect, love and honor to you guys. Mm 